Hello, my name is uh, Christian Woche and I'm a sound guy. Um, I stopped touring in my younger years, so now I'm a resident mixer in a rock club called Rockschicht. And um, besides that, I'm writing reviews for a couple of German pro audio magazines like Bonedo Pro Audio or Tools for Music. And um, hey, I do these nice cases for the Waves LV1 system. So if you're looking for a case, look us up on the internet under soundsurface.info. Thank you. I do sound for a living since almost 30 years now and uh, back in the days I mixed shows for Keith Caputo, Doggy Dog, um, The New Roses, Evergrey and um, beside the live work I also do studio work and uh, I recorded the latest releases for Satan Hammer, Born From Pain, Motor Jesus so it's, um, I'm a rock guy. Okay, why do I use DigiGrid? I bought the IOX because it serves both of my world. I use it live, I use it in the studio, and um, yeah, that was the main reason to take the DigiGrid train. Um, as a writer, I was lucky enough to do uh, reviews on nearly all or most of the uh, SoundGrid I.O. options that are out there. And uh, from my perspective, they are all quite good. But sound-wise, the DigiGrid uh, stood out to me. It's very clean, very pristine. And um, another feature that I really like, uh, I used to um, work with a lot of hard rocking bands. so. The um, built-in headphone amplifiers are loud as hell and um, they do sound fantastic at the same time. So all I can say I'm very happy with the DigiGrid stuff. I was always a fan of working digital. Um, I guess I was one of the first odd fellows that used an Yamaha O2R for live work when everyone else was dragging around their Midas XL consoles. And uh, after the MR I looked uh, deeply into the uh, software audio console or SAC that was uh, invented by Bob Lantini. And I used that for a couple of years. But uh, after Waves came out with their LB1 system I found a new toy that I'm now using live and in the studio. And uh, I love my DigiGrid IOX as my main interface uh, at the FOH when I'm doing live shows and uh, as well as my main interface in the recording room and normally it's um, placed in the control room right next to me. I'm basically doing everything with it. 